right, we're taking a look at a trailer for Trench 11, which I have determined is about one of two things. One, an evil trench coat that has gone mm -hmm. crazy, which I would watch that. Mm -hmm. Or, uh, you know, a trench like war. War yeah. War 1, War Day, well, not two, but one trench. So, uh, either way, let's check it out. I'm gonna go on about it again. Uh, the, you know, the old statement goes, it, it, you know, you don't necessarily have to go for something new or different or unique, right? Yeah. You can redo something that's done before, it's just a matter of how well it's done. This is a mishmash of so many things that have been done to death. Yeah. I mean, it's in World War One, so... There's what, that. Different setting? Yeah, that's that's all I got. Different setting. Otherwise, the, by the book. You yeah, know, viruses. The little wormy virus thing everybody infects has people. to kill each other. other. Yeah. Uh, and so then it's how well is it done? Yeah. And from this trailer, I have to be honest and say, it didn't look like it was done all that well. No. Didn't uh, really catch my attention either. Didn't really catch the attention. And maybe it didn't catch your attention, honestly, because you've seen it so yeah, many times. Yeah, yeah. Really? I was hoping for something else from the beginning. When they yeah. were opening up the door, it was like, maybe there's some creature or something. And it's like, that. oh, it's a virus. Uh, yeah, like, could, yeah. There's the worm. Uh, that just yeah. wasn't. And then they're just fighting each other. Yeah. And, you got the... and they've got the guy that's probably controlling the whole thing. Well, he's, and he like... just happens to be German. Oh, yeah. Of course. Of course. Come on. Yeah. Come on, man. It's Seriously, too easy. Low, a low hanging fruit. Mm -hmm. But then it seems to all be low hanging fruit. Yeah. That's my point. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not saying that every horror movie's got to be unique and different. Okay. Right. It doesn't. But it's just how well you take something that's been done before. Mm -hmm. That's the point. That's the point yeah. of all this. I, I'm not seeing it. You're not no. seeing it. Uh, you know, and, and I'm not like that, but I mean, like, there's a lot of gunshots, but yeah. I didn't see. Blood. No, I didn't see people falling. No, just that falling. last scene was good, but that was it, the, and it was just you know, a second, and then and then that's it. Yeah, and it's like you know, yeah, and I mean, you know, and, and you don't to put future cult classic on something is really yeah. bad. Yeah, really bad because you you a cult classic is something that just it comes about yeah. organically. You don't, so to yeah, speak. you can't just say this you can't will say be. It. You can't make it to be. Right. You know, we the audience. Yeah, and that's will be really the setting judge. a high expectation. Come on. Well, it like, is. It no, is. You know. No, we the audience will decide yeah. what is a cult classic and what isn't. Mm -hmm. You just make the movie. So. Exactly. Uh, obviously, a lot of accolades at the film festivals. Yeah. That I saw maybe that. we missed something. Or maybe, you know, again, these film festivals are just a little hungry for material yeah. these days. All right, well, my idea for a killer trench coat is still safe. Mm -hmm. So, what do you guys think? Let us know in the comment section below. And as always, like and subscribe to the channel. Bye.